Hey there, it's uh, one week later, Saturday morning, back at the NSR. Well, I'm hiking there anyways. Pulling my cart across the field. Trying to get to the river. Things I do for that shiny stuff. Okay, I'm all set up. Pushing dirt through it now. Getting the pump down there. Here's what's going on. Last time I made that big hole there. But the water was all the way up to about right here. So the water's way down. This is awesome. I got way more room to work. Uh, show you what the hole looks like when it's bigger. Okay, it's about noon and I was I was high banking up there, digging in that hole. But uh, my pump ran out of gas, so Thought I'd test down here, I was eyeing this up. It was all just kind of, um, you know, it was all underwater before. All this flat section, I mean, it's full of black sand when I dig into it. And my first pan that I did a test of had easy, easy one to two hundred colors in it compared to what I was getting like 30 up there. So I quickly moved all my gear over and, uh, it's gonna be way better down here, but it's way harder digging. I gotta use the thick axe to break this up. So, it's hard work, man. Hey, so we're back in Red Deer. Um, it's the same night as I was just at the river. And I've got uh, my laborers uh, helping me with the cleanup here, so. Oh, don't touch the lantern. We've got really good color so far. How do you get all the gold? And we're just out? getting into it. Lincoln, be careful with that. Dad, how much money would that be worth? Not very much money. Not very much at all. But it all adds up. Yeah. So we got Team MLO Blaze here. He's uh, getting in on the action of, of spoon feeding. He just put one spoonful in there. It's hard to see, but you can see it. There's quite a bit of color. Holy, look at it all. Yes. MLO Minor League Outdoors. Check it out. <laughs> it's pretty much about hunting. Mm -hmm. Well, that's pretty much all. Holy, look at the color from two spoons. Ooh, that was a good one. Look at all the color that showed up in the middle. Oh, wow, that So, here we are. They just spread the gold. We've already cleaned up that mat twice. And that's what my pan's looking like. That's uh, pretty sweet. And there's my Hey guys um, At West Saskatchewan River again It's the next day uh, Me and Tyler came back I got a really good gold yesterday So I'm excited to See what I get today And total them both up So Here's my setup That's what I dug yesterday, that hole. Today I'm working right here, digging into the same stuff. But, uh, got over a gram for sure, I haven't weighed it up. But 
It was a good dig yesterday. So, I'll show you what we got in a bit. Okay, I'm home. I'm doing my cleanup. You can see all the color in there. I've only done about 12 spoonfuls of material. Crazy amount of gold in there. And I'm just starting. Can't wait to see this clean up. What's up guys? Back from the river. Got my gold all dried up. Time to weigh it up. A lot of hard work for that gold. Let's see here. Two point two six nine grams of gold right there in that cup. Last time I weighed up my flower gold, I had half a gram. So that is way better. Sure love this stuff. Can't wait to get back out on the river. Heading out again next weekend. Gonna take the whole weekend and head to a spot we heard is really good. So catch the next video.